Yo, yo, boys, back with another video. Today, we're going to be talking about uh, how it puts you in a lobby with literal bots. What should Blizzard should not... If people... Okay, people with MMR from 0CR, you should only be placing with other people that are your rating. I don't care. They, they, sure, they can be your MMR, but they need to be your rating. I'm getting people that are 1,400 CR. They have 30 games played, and I'm having some backpedaling garbage just sit there and throw my lobby. And the funny thing is, I gain 20 points for a 4-2. I lose 60 points for a 1-5. So how am I supposed to gain rating? It's not going to be possible for me. Like, that's the problem That's the problem I have with my um, with my rogue rank one and all my other classes. I don't get the, I, I get the MMR bug. Once your MMR flats out with your CR, you can no longer push. It's almost physically impossible. Because no matter how... I, if you can go... I went 4-2 or 5-1 every single round. And my MMR stayed the exact same. It never changes. Because obviously the game's terrible. And they, don't, they have no idea what MMR inflation is. When you win, when you go 4-2, your MMR should be above the rating that you gain. They, Blizzard doesn't understand that. Because they're clueless. So... People that are 1400... It, it, stop giving people free MMR. It's annoying as hell. It is the most annoying thing, and it pisses me off so much because I have to waste my time healing these people. I'm so tired of it. I hope they ban my account so I can stop playing this game for at least, like, I'll just play my brother's account if I want to log on. I'll just log on to HPOW and get the 2400 in a day because the game's dog shit awful. But holy shit. I have just never in my life... Like, the, the only time I got a Q today, and it puts me in a lobby with this. Don't give me a Q if you're going to do that. I would rather not get a Q if you're going to put me with people that are 1300 CR. I'm so, I'm, I'm tired of it. I don't care how good you are. If you are 0 CR, if you're from 0 to 1900, and your MMR is 2400, put you in other lobbies with the people that are same rating with your MMR. Stop putting them with other players. Because guess what happens? I get a healer that's 1400 CR. I lose I lose 70 points and then I gain 5. And it's happened plenty of times. They keep doing it over and over and I am so sick and tired of it. I'm, I'm not getting rewarded for playing good. I'm only getting punished for playing good. I'm, play, I'm getting way punished for playing bad. If I ever play bad, I automatically lose not only that round, but I lose the entire... If I, if I mess up one time, it's an automatic loss. One time. If I don't fake cast, if I don't play perfectly, it's 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 already a GG. And you'll see this game. I literally heal all the way to 80% dampening almost every single game, and it wasn't even close. It was not even close. Look at the damage difference right now. This is this is what I'm healing. So this guy's doing 200. They're, they're doing 200k flat DPS right now, on two targets at the same time. Now with my comp, I kind of need to push in. Guess what? I can't do that. I push in. I get hodge. I get one shotted. And then I have an Affy Lock that can sit in the back AFK and basically do whatever he wants. I literally cannot heal the pressure that's happening. They're not, this, it's not possible. He's, they have no wings up. This is just random damage. And I'm expected to heal this. Good good game, Blizzard. Good game. I'm glad that this is the, the, the state of the game. Where you just zug zug and that's all it takes anymore. It's just such a joke. Get 60 owed. No problem. I get it. I get feared. Nope, game's lost. If I get feared, but it, no, it doesn't matter if they don't have CDs. If he gets 60 o nope. Actually insane. I hope they ban me. Because I am at my edge with this game. I'm just so dumb with it. I don't think you guys understand. I had to win three solo shuffles, 4-2, to gain 60 rating back. Because guess what? When your MMR when your MMR is the same as your rating, you can't get rank one. It's not possible. So I have to wait until inflation comes at the end of the season and then try to push again. Because the moment your MMR gets to where your rating is, you cannot push. It's not possible. You don't gain enough rating. That's why Crusader didn't get rank one because he his MMR was a CR and he was only gaining 15 points and he was lo losing 60. That's what happens to me and all my characters. You have to do good from the start. So if you're ever gonna push for rank one. Unless Blizzard actually does their job, what you have to do is you have to do good from the start. So play your class when it's the absolute best. The, like It has to be the, the SS tier of comps. That's the only time you will be able to play your spec. Because if you mess up and you're not the best of the best and you don't play 15 hours a day, yeah, you're, you're, you're eventually going to uh, cross out at your MMR. 
Because if you guys what if you go three three, you're losing MMR. I don't know in what world, what like clueless person added that in. Who in the right mind? Why would you lose MMR for going three three? The amount of brain damage these people have is mind blowing. Like it is just mind blowing. And as you can see, literally my entire team's dead. They're dead. This is unhealable damage. Like I don't have I. They, they per, it is nice. It's unhealable. And this guy land hands himself. I let it trigger the sun because I literally cannot heal the pressure. Like I, I don't look what's happening in this game. Like I, this is not a joke. This is this is a state of the game right now. And everybody's like it, it's just the most disgusting stuff I've ever tried to heal. And this guy just dies because he gets why he land hands. Like I'm like bro, these players are not real. Who would lay on hands before they bubble? Because he didn't because of his lay on hands, we ended up losing. Because guess what? He couldn't bubble. And guess what? On forbearance, every Rets knows that you're supposed to play defensively until you're all forbearance. Nope. Doesn't matter if you're twenty four hundred, doesn't matter if you're twenty five hundred, doesn't matter if you're rank one, it does not matter. They're all genuinely bad. They don't know what's going on. If you look at the damage breakdown, Watch this logs damage. I guarantee when he's on my team, he's going to be doing less than everybody else, and that's literally what happened. He didn't fear a single time. When I face him, he spam fears me. When I, he's on my team, he doesn't fear once the entire game. I'm not, I'm not even exaggerating. The Affy log literally doesn't click fear on a DPS or anything. As an Affy, all you do is put bleeds up and spam fear. That's it. And then just kick occasionally, and you win the game automatically. You can't lose at a Warlock right now. You're, you're automatically a tank, you're automatically a healer, and you're automatically the best DPS in the game. The most overall DPS in the game is obviously Affy Log. But yeah, I'm fuming because I don't think you guys realize that, like, if you, you guys have to put this in perspective. Imagine, okay, so if a solo shuffle, if a round, if one round is taking five to seven minutes, which is absolutely insanity. I, if a solo shovel ever is getting over 55 to 50 percent dampening, the game's bad. That's just how it is. Stop making classes tanks, Blizzard. Nobody wants a dampener expansion. Please, for the love of God, do your goddamn job. Like at least next expansion. I know you're not going to because you've never done anything correct in your entire worthless life, and that's just the fact. And I'm going full balls deep on these motherfuckers. I don't give a shit. Fuck the ad revenue. I'm gonna speak my mind here and fuck. You know all the people that comment and they they try to defend this game. I just hope you know. I don't give a fuck. I hope I'm glad that you enjoy this game enough to where you can defend it. But usually, if I'm being honest, those people are usually like they're they're casual players and they're, they're the people that are usually like 16 or 1800 CR. If you're playing below 1800, it, the game's fun. Because obviously you're facing variety, you're facing fun stuff, and you're not facing people that are sweating their balls off. Even though I'd rather face people that are sweating their balls off, because at least they'll play good. At least I get somebody. This guy did the same thing he did last time. He lay on hands, I'm pretty sure, or he magic. He, I hope, I hope, yeah, no, he lay on hands. Any rep paladin that lay on hands in the opener is usually terrible. That's a fact. And by the way, this is a 24. I'm 2460 at this point, and this is the lobby I get. I don't care if it's 6 a.m. Don't give me a queue. Like, why am I... Like, the thing is, I've queued like this before, and I've gotten good players. But, of course, the one time I want to play the match, and I actually just... I only want to do one solo shuffle. I was like, okay, I'm going to log on. Just do a solo shuffle. Like, if we go 3-3, whatever. Nope, and then I get this. It's This is why I try to... Do, that's why I dodge queues. I literally just can't... I don't even want to queue. Because I get punished for playing good. I get punished for playing bad. And by the way, I just hope you know, the fact that they just lost that is the most hilarious thing I've ever seen. An Affy Lock losing to a Rep Paladin and a MM Hunter is the most funny thing in life. Especially as Double Lock, the most broken comp. So this guy's 1800, and I'm pretty sure three or four people are literally under 2100 in this lobby. I don't think there's, I think there might be one other 2400 person, let's see. I didn't even get to see it. But, so now I'm going to have to get on tomorrow and game my rating, which won't be too difficult because, I mean, it's very rare that I have one of these bad games. And it, it just happened to be, 
I mean, I don't think there's nothing I could have done. I really don't think there is. Maybe with, like, the MM Red, I could have pushed him more. But it's like, I would have just died. You know, like, versus Appies, you just can't do that. Like, there's no pushing in versus Affy Lock. You just get feared and you'll, you're, 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 nah. It's up to your, you know, teammates to just do their job and just do damage. As you can see, my Affy is literally AFK. And this is what I mean. This is exactly what I mean. He is literally AFK. How is it possible? And he just walled, and he's still not doing any. Di this is, and you. This is what I'm saying. When you, when I say the shit that I say, this is not a joke. This is literal. This is real life. This is real life players. This is an actual player. This is not a bot. Even a bot would know how to put bleeds up on a target. He finally realized he can put bleeds and do max damage. Look how fast he does max damage. This was in four to five seconds. This is all it took. And now he's top damage. In five fucking seconds. Now, if he did that in the first minute of the game, it might have changed something. But I, I highly doubt it, honestly. And th the fact that I love how, as a wrestle dude in solo shuffle, these brainless rep paladins can just run up to me across the map and podge me. Look at the fear DRs. I don't think there's one fear DR. Nope, there's not one. Let's see. Let's. I want to watch with you guys. W let's see when he fears. As an Avi, your job is to fear. I don't see a single fear yet. I'm sitting in the room on his board. I literally telling him to fear. No fears. No fears. Are we gonna fear? By the way, this is a 2400 lobby. So if you if you don't believe you can get 2400 in solo shovel, just play a DPS, bro. I'm telling you, playing healer is hell on earth. Like bro, I swear to God, if I was playing a DPS, I'd be 20. I'd literally be eligible for rank one in two days. Like if I, I actually just need a Q DPS, this is ridiculous. Healing has to be, like, when you're healing, you literally need to be able to play all day. Because when you're losing your rating, you have to be able to gain it back. I, I don't have the time to do that. Like, I play so good a lot of times, and there's nothing I can do. Not one fear DR. I have the right to talk shit at this point. I have the right to. We're not playing at 1200 CR. This is complete bullshit, and everybody knows it. And the fact that nobody even responds to me, I wish the motherfucker would. And I hope I get fucking banned so I can, f I, can I need to just cool off from doing solo show. Because this has happened every, every loss that I get like this, it happens just because of this. Every time. Like, I've played so good on this wrestler the entire season. And I've actually just now started to not get evokers. Finally, the evokers got their eligible rank 1 or they got high enough to where now they're stopping queuing. Because once you get high enough rated, you kind of you rarely see them. And of course, I I just can't win. I I try my life out for these lobbies, and I actually play really good, and it just doesn't feel winnable for me. Like I am I there's a few things I could be doing better, but overall I think I'm playing perfectly fine. Again, not one fear DR, and this is what I'm talking about. I have the right to talk shit to this person. He hasn't clicked fear a single, like, what the fuck? I, I just, I don't understand it. I don't understand the level of brain damage. Like, how brain, you had to have ultimate brain damage. And this is an 1800 CR player, by the way, at 2400 MMR. This is what happens when you give people free MMR. And by the way, this happened with rank ones too, and they are the worst players of all time. See, I'm starting to think, maybe rank one in solo shuffle isn't even going to be an achievement for me anymore. Like, I'm going to be honest. I mean, the fact that I've literally saw rank 1 solo shovels and then they're, they're, they're the worst players I've ever seen. It, it's unbelievable. Rank 1 should be a, something that's meaningful. These people are almost rank 1, by the way. Like, they were, if they're, if they're at 2400 MMR, the, like, right now, I was 2460, I was in the 20th spot. Technically, right then, I would be get, if, they're, if they did 20, cla or 20 specs per rank 1, I would be eligible for rank 1. And I'm getting this. So this will be a rank one lobby, or at least like close to it. Obviously, it's gonna get higher, but you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> but uh, yeah, pretty much, I just wanted to record this and show you guys what I'm talking about. We haven't feared the entire. We finally feared, or I think, or I think that each pal, uh, the ret blinded. If so, not one fear yet. He, this, this motherfucker's 10%, not one fear. We, we, we don't throw a single fear out. Not one. 
and I'm expected to win with somebody like this. We're not fearing the lock, we're not kicking the lock, we're letting him spam cast fear. We finally click Colt Coil, but it's too late, he walls at 20%. Mike, I land hands, he actually saves him, thankfully, because the war looks bad. I mean, we already know that, but I bash this guy, had the bear form, double heal myself. Put my tree form here. I'm trying to heal us up, but it's like it's getting so low, it's like I don't know what to do. I think I'm just gonna die here. I have Trank. Nope, watch him just die in a DR, like at the end of the trap or some shit. Nope, get fear. We don't kick fear. So, if he sanks me, thank God. I'm healing him as much as possible, but it's just not enough. I, how, how am I supposed to heal this pressure? I'm literally spamming heal. This, look how godly I am healing right now. I am literally doing, I am spam. there's not one global that I'm not healing with. I'm literally spam healing and we haven't clicked fear one time. So don't ever tell me that I'm just, I'm being mad for no reason. This is the shit that I play with. And this is not, this is a normal game for me. This is the players I get every game. And I have to win with these players. I have to try to get rank one with these players on every single, like how is it possible for me? Like it's not possible. I like at the most I can go 3-3. Three, three. And, and the funny thing is you don't gain rating and you lose them more. Because I had good MMR, but then I, I kept going 3-3, three, three. I kept facing Evoker. And then I just lo I, I just kept losing all my MMR, and eventually it got stuck down to where my rating is, and now I can never gain MMR. Even if I went 6 zone 20 times in a row, my MMR is going to say the exact same, will go maybe 3 CR above. I just hate, I despise the game, I really do. And trust me, I know you guys can say, oh, why don't you quit? It's, that's like telling... When you're addicted to a game, it's not even like you do it. You don't enjoy the game. Nobody really. It's very rare that somebody enjoys this game. You, a new player might, or a casual player. Unless you're getting paid to. Otherwise, you're not enjoying the game. It's not a fun game. They haven't done any fixes on the game. Like I, I, I couldn't imagine a casual trying to heal right now in Solo Shovel or just trying to play in general. It would be hell on earth. This guy literally dr hodged me. This is by the way. This is an eligible rank one lobby. This is like the, 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 uh, we don't have a single fear tar like dude this is ridiculous so these guys are sitting in the middle on top of us and we haven't clicked fear yet we have two locks by the way two locks two locks by the way I'm just letting you guys know that we have two war locks two not one two instant shrink in the trap so I can heal him because I know he's not gonna wall he's gonna walk 12% HP nice we finally click fear no, wait, did we? Yep, we finally... Good job. Now what we do is we fear the hunter. And then we go back to fearing the red. And then we fear the shaman. And then we fear the red. Then we fear the shaman. We should be triple DR fearing everything. We're warlocks. That's all you have to do as a warlock. Off your damage. Get damage rolling. Fear. 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 Kick. Stun. Damage. Fear. Fear. Stun. Kick. Damage. That's it. That's all you have to do as a warlock. And I guess we just we don't know what's going on. And you think we would win this game too? We I don't even think we do. I I don't even think it was possible for me to win this game. Problem is, I think the one thing I could have done is I iron barked. They were going the other target, so before I was gonna get CC'd, I pre iron barked them. It was bad because the other guy had a wall. So he the guy that I iron barked had CD. The guy the other guy didn't have as much CDs. I think it's coming up here when I do, and I know I I'm, I'm like oh dude I fucked up because they were going him. But I thought the game would have been over, so I just did. I was like, okay, before I get CZ, I'm going to Iron Bark him, and then this guy's going to have Death, Dark Pack, and Port. And I'm like, bro, I fucked up. They're going to swap to this guy, and he's not he's, he's not going to Port instantly, and it's too high damp. I can't heal the damage. Let's see if he Ports. He needs to Port. You got to, nope. He Ports in the middle of the map. What in the fuck? Who puts their Port in the middle of the map? All you have to do, by the way, when you're playing a lock, is put it in the back room. That's what you do. If you're if you're playing a caster cleave, all you have to do is play, put your port in the black, black, you know, the back room, and force them to come out. That's why I'm positioning on their ports. But this is the lobby. So I just wanted to get, I wanted to show you guys this, and I'm dead. I'm gonna have to gain. I mean, I'll probably gain this rating back. Honestly, I mean, as long as I just get normal players, it's pretty easy for me. And the fact that I'm even healing to I'm completely um in the first place. It's hilarious and just shows how bad the game is currently. But uh, I, I, as you can see, I literally I do as much healing as I can. I literally don't have time to clone. We have two, we have two fears, but why would we click that? I use everything impossible and we die.
So we had there was one other person in that lobby that was kind of, uh, that was my rating. All the other people were 1200 through 1800. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace, peace.